Hello, this is Dr. Sayas, and today I am reviewing Wonder Woman, which stars a DC female superhero who apparently doesn't age after adulthood for some reason. I don't know the lore of the characters. Her name is Diana, and as a child in the film, she is raised by Amazonian women, otherwise known as feminists. <laughs> Women who live in a hidden island away from man. It didn't really get off to the best start because Kid Diana seemed a bit stupid. I mean, at the start of the film, she literally jumps off a cliff because she thinks the Amazons are such badasses and she wants to be a badass. And she was lucky somebody caught her when she fell down. The film could have ended right there. It could have been a very short film. Her mother, who is the queen, tells how Ares tried to destroy humans. And he ended up fighting with his dad, Zeus. Zeus manages to wound Ares and force him to retreat and before dying Zeus leaves the god killer which is a weapon to kill Ares with when he returns. We then jump to Diana training and quickly jumps to the highly attractive an adult actress. The year is 1918 and this is when World War One is happening. The Germans invade the Amazonian island. They end up causing trouble. Since Diana is the only non-feminist in the island she decides to leave to stop the war by killing Ares with the help of Captain Steve Trevor and his crew. The first and second second acts of this movie are the strongest. The highlight of the first act is the battle on the island and also her backstory and the second act showed how war had ravaged London and Belgium. But the third act is the weakest one because it has a CGI battle at the end and the villains seem rushed to be honest. Probably would have been better if they had uh, left some of that stuff for the sequel but they all just kind of threw it together at the end. The film lasted for 2 hours 20 minutes and it made a lot of money and for good reason it's a good film. I never felt bored watching it. It had a good balance of humour and serious plot. Gal Gallat who is the actress for Wonder Woman, she's very good looking and she had a lot of charm. Trevor's crew was also quite funny. My favourite was Charlie because he was Scottish. He thinks he's the best at everything and he's as close to Irish as what you're gonna get in this movie. Then you have Samir. I also liked him because he was like this charming ladies man. I would give the film an A because most of the film was great. I loved the representation of the coldness of war. Aside from the third act there was one or two moments where Wonder Woman woman she didn't understand the bigger picture she just wanted to bulldoze through and get the job done which i guess she's supposed to be naive but it, it was a little jarring but it's definitely one of the best dc films i've seen hello guys hope you're having a fantastic day if you enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and to subscribe for more videos bye